There will not be a new trial for a Kenosha man convicted of murder, even though a police officer admitted planting evidence in the case. And Kenosha officer Kyle Bars told investigators he planted the evidence while looking into the 2014 murder of Anthony Edwards. Joseph Brantley, Marquise Tibbs, and Brandon Horick were all convicted for their roles in Edwards' death. New at 6, 12 News Nick Board reports from Kenosha, where Brantley just tried to get a new trial. The legal ramifications are still unknown of a Kenosha police officer admitting in court here that he planted evidence. But a judge just ruled that because jurors knew about it before they reached a decision, he's allowing their guilty verdict to stand. Joseph Brantley is back in court a few weeks since he was convicted of shooting the victim, Anthony Edwards, during a botched robbery. Brantley's attorney wanted a new trial, saying he only learned late in the case that then officer Kyle Bars admitted planting an ID card and bullet during his investigation. Brantley's case, he had a right to a new trial based on outrageous government conduct, including that his lawyer didn't learn of the evidence planting until months after it was first suspected. Kenosha's police chief testified today. He told the district attorney as soon as he knew, and the DA said he disclosed the report on the alleged misconduct to the defense before the trial ended. So the jury knew about it. That was enough to satisfy the judge and the victim's family. I'm finally getting some closure. Were you concerned that the guilty verdict was going to be thrown out because of this? You know, part of you thinks that that possibly could happen, but I. I truly believed in my heart that all the evidence was there and, um, and that the jury made the right decision. Well, despite the judge's decision here today, an appeal of the convictions of all three suspects is considered likely. At the Kenosha Courthouse, Nick Board, WISN 12 News. The Milwaukee County District Attorney's Office is now reviewing possible criminal charges against the officer who resigned in the midst of an internal investigation of the evidence planting.